When you look outside these bridge windows, then you will probably feel one of two things, fear or excitement. To be perfectly honest with you, 99% of most people will probably feel fear. But I, and I know a small percentage of you, felt excitement. The thing that dictates whether fear or excitement comes into play is knowing what vessel you are on and whether that vessel will withstand these sorts of harsh conditions. As you saw a moment ago, this boat is heading into waves that have been whipped up by nearly 60 knots of wind. And what better vessel to navigate through these rough conditions on than an 86 foot Darwin class explorer yacht. The Cantier Delmarche Darwin class 86 explorer yacht is built in Ancona, Italy by CDM. These still hold highly capable vessels are powered by twin Caterpillar C12 287 engines which will push this global explorer yacht to a maximum speed of 11.5 knots with a cruising speed of 10 knots. With this explorer yacht's 9,363 gallon or 42,600 litre fuel tanks, the Darwin 86 has a range of 6,770 nautical miles. As you cruise to your next destination, you and your guests can enjoy the view from the Darwin 86's flybridge, allowing you to absorb your surroundings with a 360 degree view. And when you head back down below, you will be greeted by a spacious, bright and relaxing interior. As the sun sets, the subtle tones of the indirect lighting will help to create a soothing ambiance. When I look inside the galley, I have to remind myself that this fully functioning, spacious area is located on a vessel that will take her lucky passengers around the world in conditions and on sea states which cannot always be avoided. On the Darwin Explorer 86, you will find everything you need to ensure that you can sustain your passengers and crew on those long voyages to far off lands. This Explorer yacht can accommodate up to 10 people in 4 staterooms and for a vessel of her size this number is impressive. And that is one of the reasons why the Darwin 86 Explorer yacht is described by some as a pocket super yacht. As well as 10 guests, the 86 has space for 4 members of crew in 2 cabins. And this is an incredibly roomy vessel. The Darwin 86 might only be 26 metres in length overall, but she has a total of 4 decks. The bridge of the 86 has all of the hallmarks of a vessel designed to reach parts of the world that are only accessible by sea. From her forward raking windows to the thick stanchions which will ensure that this true explorer yacht will be able to withstand the force of large waves crashing over her bow. From what I can gather only two of these exceptional vessels have been built which does surprise me. Like many of you watching this video, I have been a big fan of explorer yachts long before this rugged pedigree of globetrotting vessels became fashionable. This leads me to think that we will be seeing more of these pocket explorer yachts in the future. Or at least, I hope we will. Before I go, I know that some of you will ask about how much a Darwin 86 costs. From the research I did, you are looking at around 7.5 million euros, 
which is approximately 6.3 million pounds sterling or about 8.6 million US dollars. But what do you think of this vessel? Let me know in the comments below and if you haven't already please give the video a like and subscribe to my channel.